great job, you guys, on uh, Second Born Royals. I had a great time watching it. And I love both of your characters. I think it's great that you're paired together because I feel like you um, like have a lot to learn. <laughs> um, so first off, can you talk, um, Holly, about feeling invisible at the start of the show, the, sorry, the movie, and then how you grew in that journey? Yeah, um, my character, Mateo, is a super shy character. You know, he's very meek, as you saw. And um, towards the beginning of the film, he is quite unseen by the rest of the group, especially in that first classroom scene. He's doing his best to fit in, but it's hard for him because he's, he is very insecure. He, is, um, he has a lot on his mind and he's nervous about social settings. And I feel throughout the movie, he gains a sense of confidence to learn to trust in his, in the, you know, the people around him, the rest of the society. He learns to trust his friends. And uh, by the end of the film, you've got this beautifully developed kid that's ready to, uh, to start a new chapter. And Olivia, you must have like an inverse journey because uh, Roxana starts off just thriving off of hyper visibility. Yeah, so Rox, yeah, as you said, Roxana had quite the different opportunity. I think she had to learn self-love and that be inward and not necessarily outward as she was continually only putting specific facets of herself online and only getting what she wanted to hear in return, which is not good for anybody. Like, I think we live in a social media world and we're aware of that. So I was really lucky to have to, to be able to portray that message. Um, yeah, and as you said, she has to grapple with invisibility. She hates being invisible and not seen. So like, that's quite a hard thing for her to overcome, but it makes her superpower so much better because she has baggage that she has to overcome attached to that. I also love how I think Tuma was called you guys the breakfast club as soon as he enters into yeah. the room. <laughs> yeah. And it really felt like that in a way, because there's a lot of times you have to band together, you know, either against the adults or without the adults able to help you. So how did that translate off screen? Just the bonding experience? Um, I think we're in Oh sorry, you go first. Okay. I think we all um we all clicked very quickly, I think I can say we uh because we're all in high school, you know, we all had to do school in the classrooms. So we were always together. We stayed at the same hotels. Everywhere we went, we saw each other all the time. And um, I feel in a setting like that, you know, once you see somebody's face every single day, it just becomes a, a sense of a, um, familiarity, I think. And so um, therefore, we all just became family really quick and we all just hung out all the time. Yeah, and in addition to that, with the Breakfast Club sense, we're all very mature and um, independent teenagers. We would often go out and do things independently, relying on just one another without any parents. So we did establish that kind of having to grow up quickly. And we all have mutual respect for one another because we're all teen actors. So, you know, we know what it's like to have to work hard. So, you know, we're working hard on screen, making movies and creating TV shows, but we're also working on ourselves and becoming the young adults that we are. Wonderful. Um, speaking of becoming the young adults that you are, uh, at the end of the film, it really feels like the doors open for more adventures. Uh, Absolutely. So what adventures would you like to see your characters go on? I don't think they've stopped. I think they've got a lot more like kick and butt to do. You know, like they ha you haven't seen any of it yet, I reckon. But I think we also left them where they were just finding their feet and just becoming comfortable with their new growth. So I'd love to kind of see that personal journey as well in continuing with, you know, teenagers just being teenagers and trying to navigate adolescence on top of all these other additional pressures. Yeah, I completely agree. <laughs> Wonderful. Thank you both so much. Have a great day. Thank you. You as well. Bye.